Hello, and welcome back to Minecraft Survival. This is part 41. Last time, if you remember, uh, we built a huge... Well, we didn't build the actual track thing. I mean, we... Bleh, sorry, words. We put tracks on the bridge so that we could get from one place to another faster in the nether. Uh, that's what we did last time. This time... Uh, well, first I'm going to start off the episode with actually being prepared with another 30 level book enchantment and actually have the stuff in my inventory this time unlike last time so let's see what i get in three two one thorns and fire protection okay that wasn't a very good book um there we go so now what i want to do is today i want to actually do something that I've been talking about doing for a long time, and in a bunch of episodes as a possibility. Do I have anything any cooking? No. Today I want to go on an Enderman hunt, because we currently have two Ender Eyes. There is a chance we will need up to 12, or even more than that if we're really unlucky and a bunch of them break while we're trying to find the end portal. But yeah, so that's going to need a, about 10, well, exactly. 10 more ender pearls. So we're gonna need endermen. So I was thinking we would go up to this area over in the desert because for some reason, I don't know why, but endermen seem to always spawn in the desert whenever I go to it. It's just something that happens. It may be completely ridiculous, but it does. So I'm thinking what I'm gonna do, well first, my sword isn't doing too good on durability. So, I'm gonna make a new sword. And actually, I might enchant it. Should I? Yeah, I'll get one lapis. And I'll see what I could enchant it with. Knockback, smite, and sharpness three. Ooh, that'd actually be pretty good. Uh, it's just knockback one, isn't it? Yep. Well, that was a waste of a piece of lapis. Well, anyways, now I've got a new iron sword, which actually should probably stick with this one for now. Uh, let's see. Next, my armor looks fine. I'll grab some resources. I'll just bring... How much wood will I need? Because I want to make a little, like, observation hut type thing with the second floor. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'll just bring a bunch of glass. Just hope I don't place any of it wrong. Got plenty of torches. Uh, do I have any doors? I do. I'll bring a door. And I think that is everything. I will head out and build my little Enderman hut. If I can get in the boat. There we go. Last time, I don't remember if it was actually in the video or not, but it was a sand village. Didn't really have anything in it, so I really don't remember if I left it in the video. But, yeah, I'm just gonna park my boat here. It's like the perfect spot. So that's what I did last time. I'm actually gonna back that up a bit. Just worried about some kind of collision issue. Possibly make it get thrown into nowhere. But yeah, now I just need to find a suitable spot for this little hut and wait for it to be nighttime. Ooh, this area is like perfect. If I just build the hut in this little mid or in the middle of this little area, there is a wide open flat space. I have a feeling skeletons will definitely be a problem with this, but... Oh well. Alright, I've got my little observation hut, and 
thinking I might actually change this a bit to where, hold on one second, I'll break this door, put it like this, and then have that like this, so there will be a little dip here. Because I think what that does is it makes it so that zombies can't actually break the door. Because I think they have to be at eye level with it. I'm not actually sure though. I'll leave it and if I die... Oh well. Oh, I guess I'll just throw this sand down there. One other thing I forgot to do was I don't have a bed with me. So I can't set my spawn. I'll be right back. I gotta go get a bed. I have retrieved the bed, and it is also currently turning to nighttime, which means once I get there, I've gotta book it to the house, and then lay down in the bed so I set my spawn point, and then I guess the hunt will start. Bed retrieved. Oh, I can't get out of. Oh, leave bed. Okay, that could have been bad. Spawn point set, and now I just gotta look out, see if I find any tall black men. That didn't sound right, but there is a tall guy. I didn't bring any blocks. Oh no. Well, let's do this. No one is. Ooh, Scared me. Okay. First Enderman down. No Ender Pearls yet. Half the time I can't tell if things are Endermen or Skeletons. And that would be a very bad mistake to make. Not seeing anything. I'm thinking I might actually just go out and run around. Again, that might be a horrible idea. But it might just be what I end up doing. Because I am not seeing anything. One Enderman is all we've gotten. Do I have anything on me important? Not really. Let's go. Just avoid skeletons as much as possible. I really thought I would find a lot more of them. Or at least that they'd spawn a lot more commonly. I know they're a very rare mob to find in Minecraft, but still. I need more. Something kind of weird that I've noticed is... Like, I don't know if I've glitched out the server or the game or something. But for some reason... I have found like 20 Endermen, and only two of them have actually dropped Ender Pearls when I killed them. And I don't know why. I might just need to get a looting sword from now on and just give up on doing this now, but. Eh. I kinda wish you could get Ender Pearls from fishing. That would make it a lot easier. It would probably take a lot longer, but it would be possibility. Still nothing. Did that creeper follow me up? No. But I am still seeing absolutely nothing. Uh, there's a zombie down there. Maybe I should start looking in caves. I mean, I know it's been one night, almost. Still, this is taking quite a long time for any to spawn. Funny thing is, usually whenever I play this game, well, I'll find like 30 different Endermen whenever I go to the desert. And then as soon as there's a chance that I might need an Ender Pearl, Enderman just stops spawn. Wait, is that an Enderman or is that a cactus? I'm just gonna run in that owl. Running that? Nope, it's a cactus. Okay. Run around a little bit more. Any possibility? 
I don't think I'm seeing any. Well, that was highly unsuccessful. Finally, it's almost night time again. I gotta get back to the hut. And by the way, yes, I did get bored and dig a staircase all the way up the mountain. But I also decided to add in a bit of a floor. I kind of tracked in some sand while walking through. So, yeah. But, oh well, I can live. It is finally night number two. Which means I can finally start hunting again. And hopefully this time, actually get a pearl. Huh. Quite literally nothing is spawning yet. That's weird. Oh, there's a creeper. And a zombie. Oh. Okay, I stand corrected. Stuff's spawning now. I really need to take out all of these cacti and move them somewhere else. Because, wow, I just keep being like, oh, is that an enderman? No, no, that's a cactus. Is that an enderman? No, no, that's a cactus. I might go run around again. There's no enderman material in the area. Unless there's an enderman over there. Maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna start running around. I'm not seeing anything. Oh, actually, one thing I forgot to do. Put this torch back. I would consider even one Ender Pearl a success. Just one. But no. Can't even find Enderman. Did um did a rabbit just commit suicide? Okay. Sure. I guess I wanna run around, start taking down cacti. So stop being a distraction. But man, they just aren't spawning at all anymore. I literally haven't seen a single Enderman. Either I am incredibly unlucky, or Endermen are... Is that an Enderman? No, it's a cactus. Come on! Uh, it's just raining in this desert. Is that an Enderman? No, it's a zombie. Okay. Oh, there's an Enderman in there! No, that's a witch. It had a little particle effect, so I thought that meant it was an Enderman. There might have been an Enderman in there, and then it teleported out as soon as I saw it. Oh. Wait, what? How did I get poisoned? The witch is down there! <sighs> well, I think what I'm going to do is I am going to experiment. I'm going to try this one more time, but I'm going to do it at my house. So, instead of just running around in the area that should spawn the most Endermen, I'm just going to run around in that little unlit area, little area with the forest, see if I can find anything, have a bit more luck. Whoa. I just heard the sound of an Enderman teleporting around. Because it's raining, he was looking for a place where it could be safe. Which means it is somewhere. Is it in here? No. Is it in here? No, the rain gets in here anyways. Maybe somewhere in here? No. Is it in there? No. I don't even think that's where you lost time. Whoa. Heard it again. It keeps teleporting around. I just want to find it, and kill it, and take its pearls, please. Well, that was a boring and quite uneventful episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed nonetheless. Next time, we are not going to be Enderman hunting, because apparently I am very unlucky with that. So, yeah. Bye.